That sounds great. I will do that. This is exactly what I wanted. Sadia, wake up, dear. Yes, mom. You want a drink? Ah, uh, yes, that would be great. Also, could you refill my water, please? Of course. Thank you. There we go. Now I feel a lot better. That guy is staring at me the whole time. Not sure why. Hey, he summoned an instrument, so that's okay. Oh, she's Halder. Let's sate that appetite, hmm? We have a lot to sell as well. Still no lantern oil. I really need some lantern oil. Do you have any work? Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Ooh, bounty's great. That sounds perfect for me. There's been rumors of suspicious activity around Helgen. Legion patrols have been spotted in the area. Okay, I will uh, have to check that out. I assume you saw the Gildergreen? Mm, no. All burnt up in the middle of the wind district? No. It's part of the Temple of Kinareth. People want Tanika to do something about it, but I don't know what they expect. Doesn't sound like it would be my problem, really. The companions? In Jorvasku? They're recruiting new members, from what I hear. Yeah, I think those might have been the ones I ran into. Do you have a room sure for me? Thing. It's your Thank you. Day. I'll show you to your room. Right okay. This way. Sure. Lead the way. Oh, upstairs room, huh? Let me know if there's anything else you need. Will do. Why is there even a door if this is open here? Oh, it's like a balcony. Oh, that is fancy. That's a great room. Didn't expect it to be this great. <coughs> Why are there people in my bedroom? We'll hmm. have to have a pint together sometime, you and me. Ah, uh, I don't think so. I will have a snack, though. I seem to sleep quite a long time every time, but that's fine. It's a little bit dark right now. Still, still early in the morning. What a poor old. Is he nothing? So don't talk to me about suffering. Yes, I know it's cold. chose his side and he chose poorly. And now he's gone. Such is the way of war. The sooner you accept his loss, the better. I will never accept his death. My son still lives. I feel it in my heart. So tell me, Battleborns, where is he? Where are you holding my poor old? <laughs> Do you believe this old Holding him? Why, I've got him in my cellar. He's my prisoner. Face it, cow. Your stupid son is dead. He died a storm close Dude, crater. he's so and rude. You, you best keep your mouth shut before you suffer the same. Come on, father. There's nothing more to be said here. What the hell's going on here? May I talk to you? All I can think about is my son, my soul. They say that he was killed, but I know better. I know my son is alive. Those battle born, they're in with the Imperials. How oh, are they, huh? They know it too, and yet they lie to my very face. It's not wise to discuss it here. Please, if you truly wish to help, meet me at my home. I'll tell you the whole story. Okay, I might do that. This seems like a little bit of a strange situation here. Uh, I don't know really where she lives, but I'm sure I'll find out. Ah, this seems to be her house. Oops. Did not mean to do that. Just turn off the torch. Welcome to our home. 
Thank you. Mothers, what's the meaning of this? Who have you brought into our home? Agrostein, put that down. She's here to help us find Thoros. How do we know she's not spying for the Battleborn? This was foolish. We can't trust anyone. Who knows what they'll do if they find me? Yeah, I'm right here. You can just talk to me. I can't take any more of this. No weapons, please. Let's just talk. All right, mother. I trust you're not planning any trouble. Me? So, Never. Here to help? Well, I don't know what's going on even. My brother Thoroth. He was fighting for the Stormcloaks and went missing. Everyone assumes he's dead. But he's not. I just know it. The Imperials captured him, and they're holding him someplace. The Battleborns know where. I'd go and search their house for proof, but they want me to. I'd be captured, and then we'll never know what happened to him. So I need someone to find that proof for me. And I'm guessing that someone would uh, be me, huh? Anything that confirms that Thorald isn't dead, but is being held captive. I know those Battleborns have it. They'd be hiding it, of course. Wouldn't want it to get out that they've been lying this whole time. But you might be able to butter them up enough to lower their guard. Hmm. The Battleborns. The Emperor's biggest bootlickers here in Whiterun. Their connections to the Empire and the Legion are well known. When Thoralt didn't return home, there was no question in my mind. They knew Thoralt supported the Stormcloaks, knew he was gonna aid them in battle, made sure he didn't come back. Locked him up someplace to get back at my family. I'm sure of it. That sounds crazy, but sure, I... As if you didn't mention to anyone that you saw me here. Sure. Uh, I might uh, go investigate that. And I'll find some free time. But before I do anything, I really need to find some lantern oil. Ah, the general store. Everything's for sale, my friend. Everything's for sale, my Right. Friend. Everything. If I had a sister, I'd sell her in a second. That is terrible, sir. That is really Take bad. Lantern oil. All of your lantern oil. Because I really need that. And some lockpicks. That might be good too. Oh, zap. That sounds great. You know what? I think I'll actually pick that up. Alright, that should be fine for now. Do come back. I might. I might. I don't like the way he said that, though. And I should probably also equip my lantern. Uh, so I want to give a quick shout out to another YouTuber as well. Uh, his name is Napiet, and he does a lot of uh, Skyrim videos as well, uh, among some other things. But he was kind of the main reason almost why I finally decided to um, make a Skyrim series, pretty much. Because I, I kind of wanted to do a series for a while now. Uh, but this is a huge game, and uh, it would have taken a long, long time to... To go through this all right uh, but what he does is he uh, he kind of edits a lot he cuts out a lot of the boring traveling parts in between um, and he also splits his series into seasons uh, which is something I didn't even think about so instead of going you know from like the beginning to the very end in one season it's mostly like 20 ish episodes or so and if it feels like you know that's a complete story or something that feels like a good spot to end it uh, then the season would end and that way you don't like get yourself burnt out on the same game uh, you kind of have a goal to work towards too you kind of have you know an achievement at the end and I think that works really well and that kind of is what how I convinced myself to I guess finally start uh, with this series as well so yeah go check him out I'll put a link in the description he is pretty funny in my opinion he has a very dry humor which I love and uh, I think you guys enjoyed as well. Now, what is this? Now, this looks interesting. A way shrine. As you approach the enigmatic ruin, of, uh, a mysterious note blows through the wind, twirling at your side. Out of curiosity, you decide to hold onto it. Ooh, a strange note. What could it possibly say? I have returned home from my travels and brought with me. Uh, goods of peculiar design. My disdain for traversing through the rough winters of Skyrim was distracted by the amount of valuables I managed to collect. Luckily, not much snow collects here. Some of these metals appear to be forged with such precision uh, they have engraved Dwemeris uh, characters and appear 
rather different than the others. I would normally be overwhelmed with ambition, but something else has caught my eye. Alongside these Adwemma artifacts set a mysterious ball that radiated with pristine beauty. It is apparent that it belonged to a more ancient culture despite its saturation, but I have yet to see anything like this, at least not within the ruins of the Dwemer. Could it be? No, the rumors could not be true. There would be promising evidence of this. Each time I peer back at the Alab Alabastrian ceramic, I can only be reminded of the Skyrim snow. This expedition has me concerned. My thoughts just surrounded and drowned in snow. I desire more evidence, yet require more rest. I gather some more leak to have for the stew tomorrow. It is with deep regret I hadn't settled in a place with more open land for harvest. However, I had no choice as crossing into Skyrim from Hammerfell took quite a toll on my welfare. I will continue my research when the, when the next sun shines. Someone else that traveled from Hammerfell here just like me. Okay, interesting. I also have... The bounty I never looked at. By order of Balgroove the Greater, to be to all able-bodied men and women of White Run, the bandits located in Halted Stream Camp have been harassing, robbing, and attacking citizens and visitors. Okay, I think this is actually pretty nearby from what I remember. I don't know these areas too well, but that I kind of sort of remember. And because I knew a new learned a new spell, it is getting pretty cold in here, though, unfortunately. Uh, but maybe my fur armor will be enough for now. Um, I should probably not stay out for too long here. The message mentioned that he went from Hammerfell to Skyrim, just like me. And the kind of the perfect spot to do this, and the same way I came, is through Falkreath. So um, I might want to go back there at one point and see if I can maybe find this person as well. Oh, there looks to be some ruins over here. Maybe I can take some shelter there for a little bit. And wait this rain out. Wouldn't be the worst idea, maybe. Oh, hello, Mr. Crab. Nope. Where are you running to? You guys are not so friendly. I want to try to avoid you. And get rid of you while I can. Oh, my arrow bounced off of him. Interesting. Still killed him, though. Poor guy. Oh, who are you? Okay. Bunch of bandits around here. Are you sure you want to do this? I see one up there as well. Must have been all of them. These bandits. They seem pretty common these days. There's so many of them around these areas here. He has a nice iron sword though, but. Ooh, destruction spells, Castrampus and less. I think I'll take it with me, even if I don't need it. Uh, I might sell it. What kind of battle axe is this? This is a two-hander though, unfortunately. Let's make sure there's no one around here. And maybe, you know, it wouldn't be a bad idea to actually try out one of my new favorite requirements here. Zap. Oh, no, that is not correct. Please go into the right hand and I'll do this. I should really get a better sword. I don't feel... Oh, there's someone. I don't feel good about wearing these Imperial weapons. It's not the best spell, maybe. I mean, I'm not very good at this yet. 
that magic. Sword still suits me the best here. Yeah. A little bit weird how it flickers sometimes when the time goes down. Falma, this looks really nice actually. And I like this hood. I might, I might take this hood. That's a pretty good stab actually. All right, are we good here now? Man, this weather's terrible. I'll take your food. I don't think you guys will need it anymore. Looks like you guys have a leak down there. <laughs> what is this place up here even? It's a book. Ooh, they have a forge up here. Interesting. A necklace of resist wind. Increase wind resist by 15%. And another Tome of Healing. Is this different from what I have though? I don't think it is. Can I learn this? No, because I already know it, okay. I still have this one as well. I think I should just learn this. Might as well, right? The Lunar Forge. Lunar Weapons. It seems that once the sun has gone down, the lunar weapons take a vampire-like ability, transferring a small amount of health to the victim, uh, from the victim to the user. Ooh. And some useful knowledge about smithing. I'm actually gonna take this book. Seems like it might be worth some. If not, I can always use it to light some fires at night if I have to. Okay. Good to know that there's a forge up here. I guess I'll take over this forge. And they have some iron here still. Very nice. Seems like there's more to this place. Silent Moon's camp. You know, one thing... I sh should probably look this up. I haven't yet. It would be nice if there was a mod that would... Disable certain names from NPCs and such until I talk to them. I think that would be kind of neat. Because, you know, I don't know these places. Uh, maybe until I like discover it myself or something. Oh. I don't know if there's something like this. I should check it out eventually. But we did level up. And I think. Um, I'm gonna go with more health at this point, I think. Now, what do I want to increase here, though? I think one-handed wouldn't be a bad idea. Just get a little bit more damage going here. Uh, what do we have under destruction, actually? I've never looked at this tree, to be honest. Cast novice level destruction spells for half the magicka, I see. Uh, I, might, I might do that later. I think just going with my, you know, the things I'm comfortable confident with... Uh, wouldn't be the worst idea, okay. Hmm, you guys have some meat here. Don't mind if I do. Well, this would be a great spot to um, check out my new lantern as well. Let's turn on my lantern. Keep this place a little bit brighter. Oh! Magic shield. Nope. Don't I have a resist wind thing? Well, he didn't have a resist death thing. Ooh. His guts are like spilling out. It's not a pretty sight. Leather brown bear claw hood. This is a pretty good hood, actually. I think I will take that. I don't currently wear a hood, and here's the thing as well. I don't like helmets. And I'm stuck. Why am I stuck? Okay, that was weird. <laughs> I have a tendency to get stuck in games, and I don't know why that is, but it seems to happen quite often in almost every game. So that's a little bit funny. Okay, unfortunately no one dropped a key here. Um, but yeah, I think there's a mod that lets you hide the helmet, even though you're weird. 
I hope that's a thing, because it's, uh, it's not good to miss out on the helmet slot. There we go. So just for cosmetic reasons, that would be pretty amazing. Oh man, these guys have a lot of things. Oh, there's a Luna weapon here, actually. I'll stick with swords, most likely. That's what I was trained in. That's what I should be using. Don't need a cattle. Ah, I'll take a food, though. I am actually getting a little bit hungry here. And more treasure, huh? Ooh, nice. The Wheel of Pain amulet. Okay. Sure. Um, but yeah, if I look at this, let's see. The helmet I got. Because I need to also make sure I stay warm. So there definitely has to be some... I definitely need to make some... Um, sacrifice here if I want to, you know, between looking good but also staying warm. Ah, uh, it's not... It's not terrible. Uh... What about just the hood? You, yeah... I mean, the cab is definitely warmer and has armor, so maybe I'll just stay with that for now. Uh, I, I don't mind this fur armor, it looks actually pretty neat, and it will be, you know, super helpful around these parts of, of uh, Tamriel. And actually, I leveled up again. And I will go with stamina. And... I will go with light armor. What do we have here? Increase armor rating by 20%. I think that's not a bad skill to use. Survival is the key here. Okay, there's another chest. Definitely worth it. It's still raining, unfortunately. Might as well turn off my lantern again. I don't want to waste my oil. Yeah, I should really not be outside at this point. But I just want to have a quick scout around White Run. The banner camp must be nearby, I feel. Oh, speaking of camp. Maybe just. Ah, you. You're poisoned. I'm also disoriented, it seems. These little... Ugh, I hate them. Hate them. Okay, let's... Uh, let's take care of some things here. First of all, I need to drink a little bit. And have a snack. Okay. A little bit more, actually. Let's eat some vegetables. Always good. Luckily, I have a healing spell. Alright. Well. There's something going on down there. I don't think that's friendly. Have they seen me yet? They have not seen me yet. I don't think. Well, they will have seen me now, I guess. Ah, there we go. Well, that worked out well. This is their camp. I knew it. Couldn't have been far away from where I was. Ew, what are you guys doing here? A mammoth snout. Huh. Doesn't look like their leader was here, though. God, this weather still going crazy. Okay, there's a cave here. I'm gonna assume that there's gonna be more bandits down in this place. 